All right, so lesson 39 is on multiplying decimal numbers. So here we have 0 0.25, and we're going to multiply that by 0 0.7. So let's first line them up, 25 times 0 0.7. Now when you multiply decimals, um, you can just ignore the decimal point to start with. We're just going to multiply like you would any other number. Don't worry about the decimal point. Okay, we'll do that at the end. So 7 times 5 is 35, carry my 3. 7 times 2 is 14, plus 3 is 17. This is where we worry about the decimal point. I've got my answer. So to figure out where the decimal point goes, you're going to count in how many decimal places you have total. So we're going to count 1, 2, 3. See how I counted all, all three decimal places that are, that are in my problem. So again, one, two, three. So that means that my decimal place has to go over three places. So one, two, three, and this is where my decimal place goes. So your answer is 0.175. If you put the decimal anywhere else, the answer will be wrong. Okay, and this one we have 2.5 squared, okay? So, remember when you square it, it means multiplying it by itself. So we have 2.5 times 2.5. Now remember, ignore the decimal place to start with. So we're going to do 5 times 5 is 25, carry my 2. 5 times 2 is 10, plus 2 is 12. Okay, done with that one. Put my 0 down here. 2 times 5 is 10, carry my 1. 2 times 2 is 4, plus 1 is 5. Now we're going to add it up, and I'm going to add it up on the side. So 5 plus 0 is 5, 2 plus 0 is 2, and 1 plus 5 is 6. So my answer is 6.625. Now I need to figure out where the decimal goes. So again, count all the decimal places. 1, 2. Okay. So when I count over here, I'm going to go 1, 2, this is where my decimal goes. To double check, just look at your numbers. So these two numbers here are pretty close to 3. So if I did 3 times 3, oh sorry, they're 2 and a half and 2 and a half. So it's 2 times 2 is 4, or 3 times 3 is 9. So it's got to be somewhere between 3 and 9. So 6.25 is right in between those two and it makes sense. Okay, Last one, a mile is about 1.6 kilometers. Mary Curus ran a three mile cross country race. About how many kilometers did she run? So this one we're going to do, we have 1.6 kilometers is one mile and I have three miles. So I'm going to multiply 1.6 by three. Now if you notice, I did not try to line these numbers up. It doesn't matter with multiplication until the end. Okay, So we're going to do 3 times 6, which is 18, carry my 1. 3 times 1 is 3, plus 1 is 4. Okay, Now I'm going to worry about the decimal place. So how many decimal places do I have? 1. Okay, I don't have any here by the 3. No decimal places by the 3. So we're going to move my decimal place over 1 and put my decimal. So she ran 4.8 kilometers. And that's my answer. Good luck on your homework.